Hello and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day so far. Today is just going to be a super productive vlog, hopefully. <laughs> um, I'm, I have a lot of things that I want to get done today, but I did wake up with a little bit of a sore throat and it feels kind of yucky. So I'm hoping that it'll be okay and I'll feel good enough to get all my things done. I want to try making my own laundry detergent today, so I'm very excited about that. I've like collected all of the ingredients now. I'm excited to show you how I'm gonna make that. <clears throat> I'm following a recipe that I found on Instagram, so I will link that down below if you are interested in making your own laundry detergent as well. So yeah, it's just gonna be kind of a day of doing all sorts of homemaking things and um, I'm excited to take you along. <laughs> some um it's called olive garden chicken gnocchi soup i think that's how you say that word <laughs> anyways i want to make the gnocchi from scratch and so i'm cooking the chicken for that and later on i guess i should probably research how long it takes to make that stuff but probably this afternoon i'll work on making those i think i'm gonna go for a little walk it's pretty nice outside i'm honestly not feeling that great like i can just feel it like in here and like in my sinuses and stuff and yeah I'm kind of bummed about that but I might try to just do a few natural remedies and see if I can get that feeling better I really don't want to get sick I've been like super lucky all winter so far so maybe now is just my time um, <laughs> but anyways we're gonna go get some fresh air I know the dogs need to get their energy out and so I'm sure the fresh air would do me some good too. And it's finally not so cold anymore, which is kind of nice. We're back from our walk and I even bathed the dogs. They needed a bath so badly, um, but they sure enjoyed the walk. And the air outside, it just, it kind of feels like spring. So that makes me super happy. Um, I'm sure we'll be getting more cold weather yet, but today it just felt kind of lovely to, I don't know, something about the air like, um, and the smell of, I don't know, things melting and I don't know what it is, but it just felt a little bit like spring. Um, so I think before I do anything else, I'm going to make myself a little concoction and just do a few things to try and get rid of this, whatever this is, because it feels yucky and I know it's just gonna keep getting worse. So I made this for my husband a couple times, just a couple weeks ago when he was sick. <laughs> he just really did not like they have the after bath zoomies. If you hear the dogs, just ignore them. This happens every time. <laughs> but anyways, I made this for him a couple times. I found It's something I found on Pinterest. Maybe you, you guys have heard of it already. Um, it says to just mix two tablespoons of honey, two tablespoons vinegar, a dash of cinnamon, and two tablespoons of lemon juice. And mix that and drink just that. But what I like to do is just add some... Um, boiling water to that to like fill a mug so it's kind of like a tea and I honestly do not mind the taste of it I find it very soothing when I have a sore throat but my husband he does not like the flavor <laughs> but anyways I'm gonna make that for myself and maybe I'll do a little face steam with some like eucalyptus or tea tree oil or something like that and then see how I feel after that and then we'll 
get on with our day. I feel definitely better. Um, I steamed my face, drank my tea, had some lunch, and <laughs> so now I feel better and I want to quickly get some things done because, fun little surprise this afternoon, my brothers are in the area so they're gonna come over for a couple hours, which I'm very excited about. This never happens during the week, so I'm gonna try to be a little bit productive before they get here yet. So I am starting on making some laundry detergent. This pot is way too big, but it's the best I can do right now. Um, and I bought this little jar off Amazon. It has a soap dispenser like this, and it just so turned out that I had had this jug that one of my friends um, gave me. I think it was like a dollar at a thrift store. Anyways, it just so happens to be exactly the same size and this dispenser fits on here. So I was so pumped about that. I can fill them both up and then once this one's empty, then I can use this one. And so that is awesome. Um, so for this recipe, you need 14 cups of water and we're gonna heat that up till it's almost boiling. And I think you need a cup of cast owl soap. This is a lavender scent. Then you need one cup of baking soda, half a cup of salt, and besides that, if you want, you can add 30 drops of essential oil. So I'm probably going to um, put lavender essential oil in there and it'll be a nice lavender smell. I'm working on uh, boiling the potatoes for the gnocchi um, and I finished the laundry detergent tidied up and then my brothers came and they were here for just a couple hours it was super fun we just chilled and talked in different things it was super special to have them here I folded the laundry and just took a took care of a few other house things now I need to start on dinner because my husband's gonna be home in an hour so I'm gonna try making the gnocchi and then making the soup and we're gonna have salad I think it's gonna be so good
is very hot. It is a few days later and I never filmed an outro to this video because I assumed I would keep it going because I was hoping to um, do some more things. But that night I ended up getting so sick and I was sick all of the next day and I'm still like just recovering. I'm almost, I'm almost all the way better but anyways, I just got super sick so I didn't really feel like keeping on filming but anyways I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm going to link the laundry detergent recipe I'm going to leave the Amazon link where I got that jar with the soap dispenser and I'll also leave the soup recipe and any other links you may need so if you have any questions about that definitely check out the description of my video um, but anyways I hope that you have an amazing rest of your day and I cannot wait to see you next time